I'm Asama Amar and I'm the Head of Continuing Fitness to Practice for the General Pharmaceutical Council. How is the GPHC going to engage with the sector? In short, often and in a variety of ways. At the beginning of the programme, we've established what we call the Continuing Fitness to Practice Advisory Group. That group is chaired by Lord Kirkwood of Kirkhope, who comes to us with a huge amount of experience as a parliamentarian, but also from his initial training as a pharmacist. Archie Kirkwood will work with external organisations and to help us understand the impacts of what we're doing at an early stage and influence what we do with testing and piloting in the years to come. We're also establishing what we call sounding boards, which are specialist groups and can be patients in the public, pharmacy professionals or employers, for example. And those groups will be targeted towards the impacts that affect them directly and be able to input into the design of what we actually produce at the end. And more broadly, everyone will be able to engage with us throughout the development process, in particular through our social media activities. Um, and we've already had a Twitter chat and we plan to do more in future as well. How is the framework going to be developed? Broadly speaking, in 2015, we'll be undertaking a research and testing phase where we find out what works for the different pharmacy professionals working in different roles across the sector. In 2016, we'll take the learning from that period and we'll develop a series of pilots so that we can understand the impacts of, what, of the work that we do. In 2017, we plan to consult and agree the proposals and then start preparing everybody for the changes that might come as a result of implementation. And finally, in 2018, at some point, we will go live with the new systems. How can pharmacy professionals get involved with your work? There will be lots of opportunities to engage with the work that we're doing and the best way to find out with what we might be doing at any particular time is to email us at our inbox which is cftp at pharmacyregulation.org. What we will be doing throughout the course of the programme is involving people in the testing that we want to do and then in the following years the piloting as well and there'll be opportunities for people to volunteer as individuals or as organisations to be involved with those pieces of work but also there'll be opportunities to be involved with sounding boards or just more broadly engage with our, uh, our stakeholder engagement work around social media and the events that we're running as well. And full details of that will be on our website.